find their way to camp festival. Um, <laughs> it goes like this. Round here, these cannibal kids want to be kings, but there ain't no royalty left. Cause round here, the sirens and screams float on the wind And even the street shudders afraid of our footsteps Round here, these cannibal kids want to be kings They don't see that kindness is courage Or that sympathy sings much louder than violence They are bitter and drained Eyes of eyes stare from figures of flames Look, they puff chested, restless, nameless And they've carried their pain to the point of being painless they're the numb ones, the young ones, the new latch keys of London and they're soaking up the humdrum and it makes them want to run from the state they're in. But they're powerless, penniless, feathers clipped, they found eagles' wings in the derelict brotherhood of gang life. You know that bang bang life that shouts louder than a sarcastic teacher clapping hands twice, staring down a frightened nose. They have learned that respect comes from striking the pose that demands it. But we know, respect and fear, man, they've never been compatible. They're a long way from bat and ball. They don't play, they let daggers fall from blood-soaked fingers. While their siblings lie bleeding in hallways dead. But mate, that wisdom has always said, blood begets blood and keeps spilling. That's why the pavement is stained and my heart is grief-stricken. Cause round here, these cannibal kids, they wanna be kings, but there ain't no royalty, there ain't no loyalty here. It's just sirens and screams that float on the wind, and even the street shudders, may even the street shudders. Cause round my way, this paranoid panic, it is seeping through the granite of the breeze blocks, turning our cities into sheep flocks. I pity those whose knees knock, the victims of that media machine, those poor souls who have forgotten how to dream. But it seems that that cutthroat mentality that gets encouraged in business. In business, they tell you that to be a success, you gotta step on some necks. So big money is made through that corporate pursuit. I mean, they're selling water and they're jailing kids for selling a couple of zoots. But we were born into blood-soaked cities of industry, informed of the savagery, the infamy, the barbarity of history, controlled and contrived and depressed, detested and stressed out and vexed. And it's a message we've been fed so that we could propagate the system of division, inhibition, viciousness and contradiction. We were suckled on the milk that they soured, told the future was ours, then disemboweled and disempowered. We've been disgraced and deafened and even deflowered. Our brains brutalized and our defiance devoured. And so now they're shooting guns, they're robbing cash, they're trying to claw a little back. But when the whole pain shatters, it always starts with a little crack. And the splinters, they stretch out for miles. They're pointing fingers at sharp suits with wry crocodile smiles, but it's us we get the blame, told that life is all exchanged, told that we are the children of capital, that we are the children of apathy, that we are the children of this rapidly changing reality. I'll stand right here and I'll say we learn it from them, from their rules and their ways, because their legitimate businesses deceive and disgrace. For us, we just do what we can because we live in this place where the truth can't be seen in the face. Yeah.